Fat Mike, Michael Cooper, aka Fatty the Driver. And uh, I started driving probably when I was like 12, 13, out here doing all this stuff. And then uh, got jammed up. I called the streets, got jammed up, caught my first case when I was 17, went to the joint, came home. You know what I mean? Uh, trying to keep it all positive since then, man. Stay out the streets, stay, stay out the way, but you know, shit happens in Kansas City, man. And fell back into the same trap, fell back into it, went back to the joint. You know what I mean? Now I'm out here now just trying to make a difference, man. So the little, the little homies ain't got to do what I had to, you know, go through what I had to go through, man. Us as a community, we don't really have a way to um, resolve conflict without violence, man. We wouldn't talk to Talk to your talk to your man, man. Figure stuff out, man. We all we know is go at it, handle that. It's, we got all this built up energy, this built up hate, and we just we can't we can't come together on nothing, man. So we brought this, put this together, man, because this is what we do on the streets. This ah, you catch me on that highway back there, get straight to it. You know what I mean? Police around, I don't give a damn. I'm running them. You know what I mean? But this is a way that we can come here, bring everybody from every hood, the Crips, the Bloods, Vice Lords, whatever they bang it in one spot to enjoy themselves, to see us do the things we do that we'll be known for doing, man. And um, if this can unite our people, our community, together even for a couple hours, man, to where they drop all the bullshit, keep everything solid, man, it's worth it, man. Another life saved out here. It's all, it's, boy, you don't even, I'm so sick. I am so sick of pressing five for all my homies locked up in the joint, man. I'm so sick of them. I mean, I love them to death, man. They baby mamas come every five minutes. They need this, they need that, man. When my dude supposed to be out here right beside me, man, making that, making shit happen for their family, man. It's, 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 it's getting out of control, man. It's getting out of control, man. So it's like, man, smoke the tires, man. Act the fool, man. Don't smoke the homies, man. You know what I mean? Just keep it all positive, man. Keep it positive as possible, man. We can, get, we can get free tires all day long, right? What do we need to do? Put what together? With three, probably guys? need three inch screws, but yeah, he needs to get them together see, more like, than a barrier. Huh? See, like, I can, I have one set up. So if you, because if we had a stack of tires, right, we'd take all the tires that are the same size mm -hmm. and make a barrier, okay. right? So it's 72 tires in one barrier, which would cause some weight, right? If we put all these together, then if a car, because nobody is coming like full, like that. Nobody's coming like that. It'll be like this. So if a car just tap the tires, well fuck, the cars will bounce off and whoever's behind it, it'll bounce back. No harm, no foul. But without it, that's why we line the tires up to give somebody like, uh, you know, so when they spin it, they can know where not to be. So the screw's gonna go in through here? All right. You're gonna have them like that? Let's see. All right. See, if you glue all of them, if you screw and glue, like you screw and glue, bam, you got that. Then you do, you do four rows like that. Then you do, then you hit them here, hit them there. Right? With more. Yeah, with more screws and more glue. Then you glue these down on top of. Them. Uh -huh. Then you take a uh, fucking uh, some plywood uh -huh. and put across the top and make it flat. Gotcha. So then it's like more like a table. Then you just take some fucking banners or whatever. Uh, some spray paint, spray paint them, and fuck. Now it looks good. Now we done solved. We done solved two fucking problems with one solution. Now all the tires we use it. Can I get wasted? Now, now we have a safety barrier. Is that what those water barriers are gonna be? Right. The, 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 see the, the thing with the water barriers. See, so I sit back and I watch the videos, and I'm in the car, and then you see people. They don't understand. It's like an invisible barrier. You know what I mean? It's just, it's invisible. Understand? This this is just a barrier to keep your ass back. So when I put the tires out, that don't mean be on top of the fucking tires. I mean be behind the tires. You know what I mean? So when you see this tire motherfucker coming too close, get your ass out the way. But people are retarded. So I, instead of me looking out for motherfuckers, I just want to go ahead and put them barriers and line them bitches up all the way here. And before we get the show started, every last fucking kid, if you got your kid, bring your big ass ass over here. And now we ain't got to put the cars there, so now we got real, we got real estate here. Gotcha. We got more people that can watch the show. And these barriers, you had to climb the fuck over them. 
You know what I mean? You can't sit on them. You know what I mean? So if a motherfucker car came through, smack the barrier, no harm, no foul. Nobody gets hurt. And then once you, they all lock in. Okay. They lock in place. So a car can't come through them. A car come and it'll push all of them together, but nobody get ran the fuck up. So that's like a quick solution to a major problem that everybody that watches. What about this and what about that? I'm like, well, we all can drive. And then, and if you notice, I shut people off when I know they can't drive. That horn is like the most important thing, nigga. Listen to this horn. When you hear the horn, stop. That's it. So when you can't drive, man, simple. If you can, go ahead and have fun. You cause too much smoke, I can't see you, man, stop. If you fuck up, stop. Come on back with a clear mind. I don't know, maybe something was on your fucking brain. <laughs> but come back with a clear fucking mind. Watch some more people, learn your dumb ass how to do it, and be back at it. If you can't figure it out, take your ass back there in the back. Plenty of fucking room, nobody to hit but the fucking brick wall. You know what I mean? But it's all about safety. And I kept saying I wasn't going to have the show until we got the barriers. Because it's, it's bad enough on my mind. When I'm in here, my mind, for one, I'm responsible for everybody here. So my mind is like here and out there. You know what I mean? So when they in here, I'm just worried about somebody getting hit by a Not hit, but just Still there. out there. I'm worried about somebody getting shot. But when the police come rolling up on their four-wheelers, Who's that? I'm not worried about that no more. Now I'm just staying focused on this. So now I'm watching. I'm watching. Watching. Motherfucker getting too close. Man, you're getting too close. Now, when it, it's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So now the crowd is making the circle what? Small. Everybody's coming in. We need room. You put these barriers up, they can't come. They bam. Everybody's stuck behind the barrier. Then you start getting people where they need to be. The fuck over there. You know what I mean? Make a fucking circle, stay the fuck out the way. 